We're here at Perry's today with British touring car driver Paul O'Neill, who will be taking a closer look at the Kia Sorento. We're here at Perry's Kia. We've got the fantastic looking Sorento here. This is new for 2013. Right. My friend for the day is Alan Smalley. Alan's going to be chatting around the car with us and we're going to find out quite a lot about the car, hopefully. So, a beautiful looking Sorento with, I think, a simplistic way of going about the trim level. So they've That's got right. KX1, KX2 and yeah. KX3. Yeah, this is the mid-range KX2. Uh, it's a very simple way the customer can pick, pick what they want from going from the, uh, the KX1. Mm -hmm. Going to this with leather at the KX2 and then the top of the range KX3. As Alan's just said, we're looking at the KX2 model of the Sorento, but there are two other trim levels available, the entry level KX1 and the top spec KX3. All house a 2.2 litre diesel engine mated to a six speed gearbox. Love the style of the car, yeah. I think it looks fantastic. Yeah. The old right. Sorento was a nice looking car, wasn't it? It's a completely different car, this. Uh, the old Sorento people loved it, but this has gone one step further on. Perfect. We know what we need to know about the car. Shall we have a look inside? Of course you can. Let's have a look at it. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right. Oh, thank you. Right, Alan, I am I am impressed. Good. This is good, isn't good, it? Yeah. This, it's brilliant. For me, Kia is a, obviously a Korean brand. That's right. Um, I wouldn't expect this kind of premium feel to the car. It feels very European. That's and, right. I mean, it's very tactile, the, the leather steering wheel, the way they finish the, the dash, it's got that sort of luxury feel to it. Yeah, the whole, as you say, the whole car just feels really luxury. I really, really <coughs> wouldn't expect it from, from Kia. I've heard good things, but really, really good. Mm. It's very simply designed, so everything's in an e easy place to, to touch, etc. Mm -hmm. If we go over here, for example, it's an all-wheel drive system, normally in two-wheel drive. Mm -hmm. If you were in a situation where you needed the four-wheel drive and definitely needed, say you're in a muddy patch or a muddy yeah. field, you can lock it into place and drive in four-wheel drive. Yeah. Alternate to that, it'll automatically go in four-wheel drive mm -hmm. if it senses it needs to. So it's There's... like an intelligent <coughs> four-wheel right, drive yeah, system? Yeah, as okay. it needs to. That's very good. Very simple again with the buttons. I can see here, I'm assuming that's cruise, that must that's be right, standard yeah. on the car. Yeah, it? it's yeah. standard on that. Bluetooth you must have as well, you've yeah, got. Yeah, next voice control as well as manually controlled. Would it understand uh, me? I don't know about the scouser. <laughs> it doesn't That's understand funny. me anyway, so, you know. But you learn Korean, you'll be all right. <laughs> it may be hard for some to understand Paul's scouse twangs, yet the voice control system is a reliable feature, meaning you can keep your eyes on the road at all times. And then over here, you've got your uh, controls for your radio, mm -hmm. CD, uh, and also your iPod, which uh, I don't okay. know if you have an iPod, yes, or even you. a USB if you download all your music, plug it into there and you can control it from the, from, from the steering wheel. Uh -huh. And that'll come up on the screen that'll here? That'll come up on there and play the music of your choice and you yeah. just uh, select it as you need to. Good. And has this got any more tricks, this screen? <clears throat> the big trick on this, on this particular model, is as soon as you put the car into reverse, the little screen turns into a little TV uh -huh. and you can see uh, behind you and see whether there's any kidneys or anything in the way that uh, you might, might be a problem. The rear parking sensors are just one safety feature of the Sorento. Other features are the electronic stability control and hill start assist, so no excuses for Paul. It's climate control on this model, mm -hmm. so you can set it automatically. It's dual as well, so your passenger can have a different set of temperature setting than, you, than your own. Uh, and underneath there you've got the settings for the uh, heated seats as oh. well. Heated seats, look at that. Not only can Paul ensure he's warm via the seats, but the other luxury features fitted as standard include 17-inch alloy wheels and self-leveling suspension. Moving on to storage, we've got a fantastic glove box. That's right. Real good size. Door bins either side look great. Yeah. In you've here got storage well. for bottles and things like that in there as well mm -hmm. if you need a drink. And then a big centre console there to, to put your things out, out of sight. That's one of the biggest I've seen. That's really, really good. Loads of leg room, great seating position. This car to me feels really, really big, but mm. I am so impressed. This is yeah. really good. You could have a sale here. Oh, I'm, I'm sure we will. Excellent. <laughs> right, I think we should move on to the rear of the car. Yeah, no problem. Perfect. Let's give it a go. The arrangement of the seating is really flexible and easy to change. Passengers can just kick back and relax on the longer journeys. Look at that. Yeah, there's loads of room. Isn't there? Yeah, brilliant. I don't think I've had this much room on one of these jobs before. Mm. This is this is pretty good, isn't it? Yeah. You could probably fit another, I don't know, another 10 inches of me in here. 
yeah, longer well, legs. plenty of headroom. Uh, the other thing is, if you do want a little bit more comfortable position, mm -hmm. there's a little bit of uh, rake that you can do on the back of the seat. Oh, okay. And you can sit back a little bit further mm -hmm. if you prefer a, a more relaxed uh, seating oh, right. position. Oh, that's, well, that's good to know, isn't it? You get three full-size adults across the rear here. That's right, yeah. Definitely. Yeah. And proper seat belts as well, yeah, for safety. So yeah. you've got the cross seat belt in the middle as well. Mm -hmm. Well, that's what people just, are after, isn't it? Just one thing you've also got, if there is only two of you, you've got the centre armrest if you want to drop that down. We love a centre armrest, don't we? Yeah, That's you can have a, a lie back there, and oh. also you've got your uh, drinks holders. So my coffee addiction is going to be dealt with. Just what in you the want. Yeah. Look That's at right. that. That's and then you 12 volt adapter. It's what we're seeing these days in cars. Yeah. So if you need to charge anything, or your laptop, or whatever your kids are playing with in the back, they can plug it in and keep it charged up. Mm -hmm. Right. I'm really impressed. Is that the tricks over for this car? No. We've got two seats hidden in the back. Oh. Okay. So shall we have a look at those now? Yeah. Right okay. With all rear seats in place, the load space is 116 litres. You can increase to a maximum of 1,530 litres with all rear seats folded down. Alan, there's a lot of stickers around this place. Kia's yeah. seven-year warranty across the entire range. That's it. Yeah, it's a full manufacturer seven-year warranty. Mm -hmm. Since 2010, all the range has come with the warranty. So, for example, if you've bought a used car mm -hmm. and it's been registered after 2010, that will have remainder of used car warranty. Oh. And we even have used cars on the pitch that are brought back up to the seven-year warranty, which are on the Kia approved scheme. Oh, okay. And we do sell some used cars uh, which have the extended to seven-year warranty of the Kia approved range. Yeah. So you can be rest assured you're going to get a fantastic warranty whichever Kia you buy. That's brilliant. So it's peace of mind, isn't it, for the customer? That's right, yeah. Is it limited by mileage? It is up to 100,000 miles or seven years, whichever comes first. So it covers 99% of our customers to the seven years. Excellent. Should we have a look in the back then? Yeah, of course we can, yeah. yeah let's give it a go. Right. We've got loads of space, so whatever your activity might be, golf yeah. clubs or prams for kids mm -hmm. or whatever. And it's quite high, isn't it, as well? Yeah, yeah. so it's easy access. You can just lift them in, lift them out yeah. without having, without to, having you know, to bend, bend over and, and stretch over. Oh, that's good. But the simple thing for the, the, the getting the seats, you mm -hmm. just pull these two little straps, the one on your side and one on mine, okay. pull them back, and they presto, you've got the seats, even Excellent. with headrests as well. Look at that. And they're a full adult size. Uh, space with leg room at the front as well. There's a lot more leg room than I thought, and yeah, it's also yeah. nearly as good as it is in the uh, just the room. Right, yeah, yeah. This is brilliant, excellent. So we've got loads of leg room, loads of space. That's uh, cracking. And it still leaves a little bit of storage space. And underneath the back of the bumper, you've got a full size spare as well. That's what a lot That's of people right. would like. Yeah. Also got a jack in there, as you say. Got a lot of space to put things in there as well. Yeah. Brilliant, I'm liking it. So I'm impressed with the car. I could impress my friends by having them in the back. I have seven people in the car. Yeah. Any options on how I can buy this car? Obviously there's cash uh, mm -hmm. is one, but what most people use now is some sort of finance option. Yeah. You've got personal contract plans, you've got personal contract tyres, mm -hmm. business user plans, which obviously these are a, an ideal company vehicle, mm -hmm. and also what probably most popular is higher purchase. Right. And at the moment Kia have got some fantastic rates on higher purchase plans that they can give you some superb rates. There's, a, there's an option for everyone there, That's it right. sounds like. So even somebody like myself could probably come and buy one. You never know. This is brilliant, excellent. <laughs> I think you should shut the boot on yes, this project. Yeah. yeah. It's been a pleasure. Thanks, Alan. Right, thanks very much. Good man. Cheers. Whether you think the Kia Sorento would suit your family's lifestyle or would be the perfect partner for business, you can arrange a test drive or find out more on our website at www.perrys.co.uk today.